Alrighty, Chef Buck here, and today Camera Girl is cooking up some delicious roasted root vegetables. Looks like french fries to me, but she's trying to pass them off as vegetables. It's certainly as awesome as french fries, so definitely give this a try. She's got a collection here, parsnips, carrots, some sweet potatoes, a little bit of onion and rosemary. She's gonna peel that up, slice it up, peel whatever you want to. You don't have to peel these carrots, and definitely don't peel the sweet potatoes, because leaving the skin on the potatoes, it just tastes fantastic, you know, especially when you're roasting them in the oven like this here. Basically, you just want to make sure everything is cut up into a semi-uniform shape so that they'll all uh, cook well together. But you don't have to be militant about it. Just some general steak fry shapes. And throw an onion in there too. We just had half an onion laying around. But this onion really adds a really nice flavor and some garlic too. We just peeled some garlic and threw them in there. Just sliced them in half and we're going to toss this in here with a little bit of rosemary and these root vegetables. It's just a great flavor. Now once you got everything cut up, you can set that aside and we'll get to work on our dressing here. It's just a little bit of olive oil and then we're gonna throw in some maple syrup. That's gonna be a terrific flavor. Substitute honey if you don't have any maple syrup and then some mustard. Dijon mustard will work, any kind of stone ground mustard, but don't use yellow mustard because this ain't a hot dog. Then salt and pepper to taste. Don't be shy with it because it is root vegetables, so feel free to go crazy on the salt and pepper. Then get that all mixed up together really well, and then we'll go ahead and pour it over our cut up root vegetables, and then you want to toss it thoroughly. You want to make sure and you want to get all of these uh, ingredients coated with this dressing. You want to make sure and toss everything thoroughly with the rosemary. Get all that flavor and coating all over these things. Now pour your mess out on a flat pan and you see camera girl she made a miscalculation here because we were crazy we just cut up way too many vegetables but we're having to do two pans worth but that's okay because these these vegetables are going to shrink up you know as they roast them so as much as you start with that's not going to be what you finish with you're going to lose a lot of moisture as they roast up so it's actually going to be a lot less and plus they're going to they're gonna taste like french fries so you're going to want a lot of them so spread them out in one layer on a pan then slide them into an oven heated at 425 degrees and then they're going to cook for about a half hour and you can dance while that's going on if you're the kind of person that licks the bowl you can do that but then about halfway through you're going to pull them out you know and they're only halfway done cooking now but you want to go ahead and give them a turn you know so they don't get stuck and so that they cook evenly and if you're doing two pans like we are go ahead and switch them around so one doesn't cook a little faster than the other and then you just want to cook them for another 10 or 15 minutes to whatever doneness you like you might like them roasted more well less well whatever it gets that color and consistency crunch and texture that you're going to love that's when you pull them out look at this pan here this one didn't even make out of the kitchen we almost ate all of that in fact we only had one little plate that made it to the table because we ate so many of these straight out of the oven. But it went great with this pork loin. It's a super duper side dish for a meal. Roasted root vegetables. Mom at the pavita. Alrighty, there you go. Roasted root vegetables. It tastes awesome. Is it better for you than french fries? I don't know. I'm not a scientist. I can't say that. But I like it more than french fries. Maybe you will too. I don't know. Give them a try. Let us know what you think. And bon appetit and check out the other video. And, uh, you know, do some push-ups and sit up. You know, that's my advice today. I hope I take it myself.